So today I just want to show you a new product that we've put into the range at Protog. It's by a company called Pixel and it's a remote shutter release system. So this one is specific for the Nikon D90, D7000, D5000, D3000. Um, and why it's specific is to do with the shutter release cable that connects into the camera, which is right there. As well as the cable, you get a nicely packaged sender and receiver, which we've got here. So that's our receiver and it's got a nice secure screw on the back there so when I install it onto the hot shoe of the camera I can lock it in so that it's not going to move or fall off if I move the camera around. Also is our little remote control which will send the signal to the receiver up here to release the shutter but that won't happen until I plug in this cable so I'm going to do that now. So little 3.5mm jack goes in the side of the receiver and then for this model camera this plug plugs into the GPS port in the side here so I'm just going to push that in. You need to push it in quite firmly to make sure it's in and then I'm just going to turn on the receiver and the little red light on the top is now beeping to say that it's receiving. So. That's pretty much it when it comes to setting it up and now we can start taking some shots. So I'll just quickly show you how this system works. It's uh, the remote control obviously and your receiver. I half press the remote control button just like you would on the shutter button on your camera to get autofocus and you'll hear the camera beep to say it's in auto, it's locked onto focus now and you also get a little green light on both the sender and receiver. From there, I press the button fully and I get a shot. So that's great for if you're doing um, some comparison shots, if, you, if you're trying to compare something and you want the camera to stay in exactly the same position and you don't want it to, to move and, and that will affect the way the shot looks, it's great to be able to click away for as many times as you need and just change your subject and not change the camera position at all. It's also great for if you're doing long exposures and you don't want to add any sort of vibration or touch to to the, uh, to the shot, because obviously when you're using a, a long exposure, the, the more chance for vibration or anything like that from the tripod or someone walking past it, or of course, pressing the shutter button. So being able to do that completely wirelessly is fantastic. So I'm just gonna show you now how we're gonna set up for doing a long exposure. So I'm gonna put my camera into bold mode, and then I've got to flick the switch on the remote across to bold. So the great feature about this is that now that it's there, I can press and release the button, put it in my pocket, walk away, go and have a cup of tea, come back in half an hour when I'm happy with my exposure, press the button again, and it stops the exposure. And you get a little green light on both the sender and receiver to show that it is now focused and then it doesn't click. <laughs> oh, I know why it's on timer, sorry.